Right, it's Henry Weeder man here. So I got the pump in. It's a ball check at a cage assembly in here, and I got to get that out to get the ball out. It looks like there's a new ball in the kit. Of course, it looks smaller than the one that's in there. I, it could be a perception thing. I don't know. So here's what I come up with. I put a tissue rag on top of the ball. I'm going to use my nylon hammer to whack my um, extension so I don't destroy it because I don't have nothing. I don't want to use the punch and, and damage the ball if I got to reuse it. So this is kind of a more of a curvature. You can see it kind of fits real good. It kind of holds it level. And so what I'll do is I'll give it a couple of whacks. I'm going to set you down while I'm talking. All right, let's give it a couple of whacks and see if that ball on cage assembly will come out. And it's moving. We have, we have movement and it popped out. So now I'll show you. So my trick work, I always have ideas for things that I want to damage it. And boom, there's the cage assembly. There's my little rag. It got compressed, but it didn't hurt the ball. And you can see where the socket went into it, but it didn't hurt the ball. And the cage and ball assembly are now out. And there's the ball. And that ball, that ball could be the same size. This one's got no nicks in it. Never throw away your parts. Got my little tray over here. Anyways, I'll clean this all up. Look at all that mess. And that bushing at the bottom comes out too. I've had that come out. I gotta pop that out too. That's a seat. So all the way down there, that's another seat. So what I'll use is, uh, that'll be in my next video. I'll probably use my um, impact system, my impact wrench. I'll fit that in a collar, pop that seat out of there and clean that up. It's all the way at the bottom. See it? I do know that comes out because that has come out on another one for me. So let's work that next. All right, Henry, the Weeder Man out. Have a good night.